and theoretically this thing should self tighten because we got a standard thread and this guy is turning clockwise I'm just turning this way so we got two opposing forces going on here so um, if you're worried about getting that guy too tight don't worry just make sure it's nice and snug Four pins. No new bolts. Alright, so everything should be back together now, and uh, our next step is, well, I put the plug back in earlier into the radiator, that one that we took out. So what we're going to do now is we're going to dump some fluid back in there, and start it up, let it run up to operating temperature, and while it's running and warming up, we're going to check and see um, down in there and underneath if it's leaking anywhere, cross our fingers, knock on wood it won't and then um, after you get it up and we got no leaks and we shut it off let it cool down completely and then we'll top that system off and uh, while your truck's warming up turn the heater on high that'll help get some of the air bubbles and stuff out so Sucked down quite a bit there. I'm just gonna dump some water in because I had about a half a gallon of can of grease and I've added about a half a gallon of water back in there. So far so good, I don't see any leaks. Here's the aftermath, the floor mess, which I hate on my paper towels that I throw under there to soak it up, so now time to clean this up and dispose of the antifreeze and we're good to go. And double check my truck for leaks. Alright, so there we go. I ran this thing for about 10 minutes, no leaks, and um, cleaned my floor up. It happens. But anyways, um, it's about 9 o'clock and with my hour in between there, it took me about 3 hours. Uh, if you had your tools all together, maybe two and a half or two if you're speedy about it. I kind of took my time and didn't rush through it, but uh, there's not much to it. It's pretty simple. And yeah, there you go. So after you run it, which I ran it for about 10 minutes, let it sit, let it cool down, double check your fluids, and then you should be good to go. So that's it. Hope that helped you guys out. Uh, if you like my videos, give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Um, check out my other videos. i got another video on this truck. Uh, fixing the back heat. And until next time, see you guys later. Thanks.